I was over here. Let's see if I could quietly walk up to them and get a good look at what they are. Because I know bluegill and sometimes crappy come up in here. Like later in the year though. Not this early. So I'm not sure what this could be. There's definitely fish moving up over there though. There's fish in that hole too. Definitely bluegill. Alright. I think we're gonna Yeah, there's one. I just saw a bass. Okay. I'm gonna tie on a trout magnet and see if I could grab any of these guys. The game plan for today, but if I could get um anything out of this creek that would be a bonus so i would love to try to get something out of this creek and um, hopefully there's some crappie mixed in with those bluegill maybe even some bass so we'll see what i could get done um and then we'll uh go back to the normal plan so we'll, we'll check out what's in here first trout magnet on on a little tiny hook no weight on it it's my favorite rig for uh creek fishing and it's perfect for this situation i get sight fish the um the bluegill and whatever else is in here so i'm gonna give this a go again perfect for this situation and pink color stands out the most so it's really good for sight fishing Nice chunky bluegill. <clears throat> this was not the target species for the day at all, but still nice to catch. This is my third species of the year now. Um, I'm sure I'll catch a ton more bluegill this year, but. Definitely cool to get one of these guys this early in the year. There's a ton more in there, and I'm sure that there's some other species mixed in with them, so I'm gonna get this guy back in the water and keep fishing. And right back to the school. That was a ginormous bluegill. Oh. The goal for right now, I guess, is to catch any species other than a bluegill. That's it. This little large one just slammed it. I don't know if I got that video, but he almost like came out of the water for it. <laughs> he's tiny, but he's crazy aggressive. fourth species of the year and as I was just saying my goal is to catch anything but a bluegill that, that has now been accomplished caught my first bass of the year he's a tiny guy but he's really really aggressive and that's pretty exciting hopefully I catch one like 10 times his size, but pretty happy about that. Um, now, just wanna find out if there's crappie in here. Um, it's only to get this guy back, and hopefully you guys saw that the way he attacked it. They're super active in this creek for it being winter time i mean it's really not that cold for winter time here but they're super active it's kind of crazy another little bluegill on the pink trout magnet two species out here so far Bluegill and the large nut bat. Both new species for the year. 
All right, so I'm gonna end the video right here for um, the creek fishing part. I wasn't expecting to do this, but I'm happy I did. I got two new species for the year, not for my lifeless, just for the year, a bluegill and a bass. Those were like one of my really early species for the lifeless, but all you need for creek fishing is this right here, pink trout magnet. Don't, don't wait the, don't use a weighted jig head that they give you buy a little tiny hook like this and it'll drift nicely in the current and the fish will pick it up and you're bound to catch fish with it so i hope you guys can put that tip to use thank you guys for watching and please like and subscribe